Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of a Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas, I'm your host, and I'll be, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosion Jonas, I'm the man on the stage. Yeah, you are. And we're playing Breath of the Wild. Now, of course, it starts raining again, <laughs> but we found it. All right. Lo and behold. Lo and behold. We don't have to take a picture. We just have to recall. There's little glowy areas. Which is way better. Yep. That's it. Am I going to have to fight somebody? We find some story out here, dude. Somebody going to throw something at me? Shoot me? No, I'll just pull out my cell phone and start playing Subway Surfers. Subway Surfers. All right. Cool. Is this story time? It might be. He's getting his memories back. Once upon a time. <laughs> oh, I remember when Zelda gave me a at this point a kiss, Jonas, on the cheek. Way to Goron City. Then we'll need some adjustments on that divine beast so Daru can manage it as easily as possible. He's figured out how to get it to move. However, it's apparent that we still have much more to learn. But to think that divine beast was actually built by people. That means we should be able to understand how it works and how to use it to our advantage. Mm -hmm. These divine beasts. So much we don't know. But if we want to turn back Calamity Ganon, they're our best hope. Why is she British? I don't know. I never really pictured Zelda as a Brit. I mean, yeah, me neither. Tell me the truth. How proficient are you right now, wielding that sword on your back? Legend says that an ancient voice resonates inside it. Can you hear it yet, hero? She keeps asking him questions. He ain't said a word. <laughs> Typical woman, though. <laughs> Typical woman. I'm going to ask you five questions and not let you answer any of them and then be mad at you. Is that what happens? That's usually how it goes down. I, I, I don't kid. I don't guess I haven't experienced that much myself. <laughs> nah, you know what I'm talking about. You know exactly what do I'm talking about. Do I? Yeah, you know. Okay. You I guess know. I know. How do I how do I get on here, this island, dude? I really want to get on this island. Just go out there. Dude, there's water and stuff. Whoa. What the hell was that? A meteor, dude. Are you serious? This game is too good for me. <laughs> I don't deserve it, dude. I'm too trash for this game. Dude, I want to go explore the meteor that just struck. Dude, you telling me, Jonas, listen, listen. All right, listen. Hear me, listen. I'm, I'm, I'm listening to you're you not, talk, you're, dude. Uh, listen. We were, we're walking down the street, Jonas, and you see a meteorite hit like 100 yards away. You know, there's, are you like, a, there's like a grass path like right there. Are you? Are you going to go out and go you see... You have stamina. You will die. Are you, <laughs> you going to go out and go see the meteor? Jonas, are you going to go see where it struck? Or are you going to... What are you going to do? Is it raining like this? I mean... Look, he doesn't really mind the rain. He's made that clear through his well, actions Well, I'm so like far. Missy Elliott, and I can't stand the rain. No, I'm just joking. Um, uh, yeah, dude, I want to go see what it hit. Yeah, exactly! Oh, there's some flashy... The garrison. Rusty Ooh, a rusty shield. shield. Ooh, the, a rusty... I'll take the claymore, I yep. think. No, I won't take the claymore. What do I have? Oh, a Bolko spear. You know, that's worth it. Got some arc on that bad boy. Yeah, you did. All right. Here, you got some arc. So this is the garrison. But yeah, John, I would love to go see what, like, a meteorite strike zone looks like, dude. Are you into destruction or something? Am I into destruction? I got a taste for destruction. Pile of leaves in here. This is not worth my time. This is not nearly as cool as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> I really <laughs> I thought mean, this is a location you found, dude. I thought this was going to be a lot cooler. Well, I mean, not everything's as cool as it sounds. Oops. Wooden bow. Another rusty claymore, dude. Boom. Right. Well, you can do one two things. You can fast travel back to uh, the lady you need to go talk to. That breaks your weapon? That's what I'm going to do. Oh, you got raw meat from the fox, though. That just breaks it? It just breaks? All right, give me another Maybe one. if it's trash, dude. I don't know. <sighs> I really want to go see where that meteor hit. But Jonas, fine? I, I, I don't. You can do whatever you want. I don't care. I don't remember where it hit now. 
I mean, who knows where it was? We thought we needed to be right up in the mountains like crevice, and turns out we didn't. Eh, I mean, yeah, we got a little close. We we probably passed up where we needed to be on our way here. All right, fine. I'm going back to the lady, dude. We're going back to the stables. I'm going to jump on another goddamn horse, of course. Horse, of course? Yeah, just freaking jump on a horse, Jones. Just F it. Just horse jump it, dude. Just horse jump it, dude? I'll just get on a horse. Uh. Didn't somebody say that you can like you can beat this game in like two hours or something if you really like just mainline straight to? Th- Is there something <laughs> weird about this game? What, what are you trying to say? You want me to beat the game in two hours? No, no, no. I'm just I was I was just like I, I thought somebody said that. It I was... mean, I'm not surprised that you can speed run this game in two hours if if that's what you're asking me. But like, I would have to like know exactly what to do. In order to do that, well, yeah, we like to give them, uh, give them the bonus love, you know. Uh, no, I'm playing a game that I have never touched before. If I was speed running, then yeah, I could beat it in two hours because I'd be like, oh, so I'll just bypass the first three bosses by, like, uh, what the hell is this thing? Oh, uh, by uh, like you know, stabbing a kindergartner or something. I don't know. I don't like stabbing a kindergartner. I'm sh- Jonas. Look, I don't, speed runners employ very strange tactics to get where they are. All right. So why didn't you get a horse from the stable? Because you gotta pay for horses and money's at a premium. Oh, ancient gear. Why do you you wild wild horses? What oh, I really need. Of, to- oh, there's a bunch of boys out here with ancient screws and stuff though. I know, dude, but I'm just going to get a horse. You see, you can't you can't have it both ways. You can't, you know. It's either I'm going to do the storyline or I'm going mean, to piss can, off in the you, field. I mean, those things, like, literally help you a ton. Yeah, picking gears and stuff. That's You yeah. pick up fruit, and yet you're going to pass the stuff that yep. upgrades your ability. Yep, because you know why? Because this thing's going to shoot me, and I jumped off the horse because I got scared, all right? My horse is on fire, and I'm dead. <laughs> my horse is on fire and i am dead now it, you know it's i don't know what else to think is the horse has more life than you <laughs> horse is cool dude don't kill the horse but. <laughs> all right where do i start from all right no i'm not gonna pay money for a, a freaking a horse here <laughs> I don't care. I'm not doing it. Yeah. Dude, yeah. Pick up this rock, dude. There might be money underneath it. There's nothing, dude. God dang it. It's doing so well. I need to, the, they need to have a fast travel point near this. This. Yeah, this. Why, the, why the heck it's like a billion miles away and there's no fast travel point is beyond me. Right? All right. Got to sneak up on the horses, Jonas. Don't, don't give them any... Any idea that you're in danger? Just hey, ho there, girl. Ho girl. Ho girl. Ho girl. There we go. All right, horse. Gotten. Get the f out of Dodge City. Protocols on. <laughs> Dodge City protocol on. Yeah, man. Get the f out of Dodge. Oh, Jonas, man. All right, you run into the wall with the freaking horse. Done. Considered and check that off your list. <laughs> I will. Thanks. You never rode a horse, did you? Have I ever been on a horse? I can with confidence say that I've never been on a I've horse. I've been around some horses. Nope. I don't think I've ever ridden one. I had a friend in high school. She she owned a horse and it was at a stable. I went with her and helped her like clean its stable and feed it and stuff one time or two times. Really? And uh, but we didn't ride it. And then my someone in my family had a blind horse, but I just remember it being in their like ba- little barn. But it never came out of the barn, as far as I know. Like when we had family functions. But I was also like a child, child at that time, no, super young. So you wouldn't even like recognize that it did stuff, or like I didn't even know it was blind until they told me that it had was blind. Why are blind animals like sad? <laughs> I mean, do you not feel sad for blind humans? I mean, you know, they're all right. <laughs> they're all right, but... What? <laughs> Wait, hold on, Jonas. I mean, I don't feel sad for... Wow. Yeah, I don't feel sad for blind people, no. I mean, I it's, it's unfortunate, but I don't think they really want me to feel sad for them. They'd be like, dude, I'm doing all right out here. I would feel sad for a blind child. 
I think it's the whole idea of like it not being smart enough to realize that it's blind and what it's missing out on. Yeah, I guess that's true. Like a blind adult, I'm not going to be like, oh, I'm so sorry you were born blind. It's going to be like, lady, I mean, dude, get out of my face. <laughs> but the animal doesn't know any better. The animal's yeah, just like, the no, animal, it's a struggle. It's just so stupid and innocent, dude. It doesn't know. Wow. Yeah. And like a blind baby, oh my God, you know, my heart would break. Right? <laughs> I had one. All right. Freaking come so tired of these horses, dude. I hate them. I hate them so bad, Jonas. <laughs> but why did dude, you hate them so much? Because they're so hard to control, man. I don't like them. But I'm right here. There's a freaking thing near here, too. I think I might try to see if I can hunt that down um, once we turn this thing into Ampa. Because that won't hurt, man. It's just more fodder for my stamina and my heart containers. The, uh, and if I find it, I can trans I can teleport back to this town. <gasps> Boom, Jonas. Double your pleasure. Ah, double, double your, your fun. fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You never exactly. thought about my pleasure or my fun. I don't think about your pleasure very often at all now. I don't know why you don't, Jonas. You never pleasure me anymore. <laughs> or ever. No, anymore. You used to... <laughs> it's not it's only because the term pleasure you just kind of like it always goes sexual but it doesn't necessarily have to be jonas you what, can pleasure what? another man in a non-sexual manner all right yeah i mean you pleasured me with some baconators <laughs> thank you <laughs> i was like shoved them right up your butt wow you loved it <laughs> now that you have seen some of the princess's memories you must uh, have started to remember certain things. Here, I will hand over to you now before I forget. Oh! <laughs> A champion's tunic. An ancient Hyrule garment that could only be worn by the one who earned the respect of the royal family. Oh, sweet. Equipping so, it or relieve the, will reveal the enemy's life gauge. Oh, I did not read that because I stopped reading. Yeah. This is this is something of yours. I've been keeping safe by request uh, of the princess. The clothing, especially made, be worn by the champion. Let uh, please handle it with care. All right, let me see if it's better than what I have on. First off, none of these menus are right. This is the right menu. So what I have on currently is only a four. Wow, it's better. After I spent all my money in time coloring my armor now i gotta recolor some stuff yeah oh, that's gonna look so good in pink though jonas right it will yeah right right oh god it's gonna be like it's gonna be a pink explosion all right i'm i mean i'm loving the blue and pink right now it's nice yeah it's not maybe bad. you should rock it right now for that it looks like you have on like a, a little blue dress with pink leggings wait what <laughs> Excuse me? It kind of does, doesn't it? It's not it? a dress. It's a skirt. <laughs> All right. Let me see if I can... No, nah, dude. A skirt is independent. It's a dress because it like it's a, it goes over your whole upper body. Oh, yeah. I guess, I guess you're right. It's a jumper. It, it looks like a dress. I know. I'm, I'm so Because everything on the side is covered where it, like, it, lo where it <laughs> make it look like a shirt. So, yeah. I think it's supposed to be a tunic, though. Yeah, you know, I guess, but I, I understand. If you if you want to demasculate Link like that, believe <laughs> me, I'm I'm fine with it. I'm not. Like, I like I like to make Link as weak as possible in everyone's mind. So then when he does something awesome, they're, they're like, "Wow, look at that guy! We didn't think he could do it. He's weak." Like honestly, Jonas, if there was like a Nintendo character that I would not be surprised who came out as like bisexual, it would be Link. What the hell? <laughs> <laughs> Why is that? Because, you know, dude, it seems to really, like, uh, look girly. Wow. Uh, you know, looks like he'd, he'd attract from both sides of the fence. Uh, <laughs> a young lad like you in the village. Hey, what's up, young lad? You aren't part of the Yaiga clan, are you? I don't even know what that is, fam. He's all excited to kill somebody. I know. Ha! I'm just pulling your leg. You look serious. Uh, I couldn't help but see that you you look good for a boy. <laughs> we, we can swear that a, a lion's to Calamity Ganon. They're a Yaga clan. They, man, they're some bad guys. And they kindly, they don't take kindly to your kind. 
because you don't like Ganon. Seems they're active again ever since the earthquake happened. <laughs> but don't worry, I don't know about that awful clan. I figured out just at looking at you that you're not with them. Please don't hold it against me. Here, take this in exchange. Give me a freaking pumpkin. A pumpkin, dude. Fortify. Take all the rest of his pumpkin, too. Fortify pumpkins. Put my heart and soul in that. They're delicious. I can give you some. Just stop by the fields and say hello. Why don't right? you give me all of them? Thank yeah, you. Word. Oh, wait. He's, he's Buy charging. Buy them? 20 rupees for one. And it's only half a heart? What the F? Yeah, it probably has like a big defensive buff or something. Oh yeah, probably. So where do you ever go to find this uh the shrine? Yeah. I don't know. That's what I'm looking for though. Um, I like to get higher. So so high. Oh, oh, oh. Can you swim up a waterfall? Jonas. <laughs> what do you think? Yeah, I bet you can. <laughs> what do you what do you think, buddy? All right, so there's, I could always I could swim up the waterfall, which is you know very va valid idea of what I could do, or I could just walk up this this hilly precipice. There it is. Mm. Here is how I get back to this place. The Neag shrine. Neag. Open up, little pig. Little pig, let me in. All right, and see, once I have this, I can teleport back here. Probably should have done this earlier. Note to self, Jonas, if we ever come to a new area, look for the shrine there so you can teleport back. <laughs> I, I imagine most of the villages probably have some sort of shrine or something mm -hmm. near them so you can teleport back. Mm -hmm. That would have helped us the last two episodes. Yes, because then I wouldn't have to ever touch a horse, which I don't understand. If there's fast traveling, I don't need a horse, right? I already know there's going to be a horseback boss, dude. A mm -hmm. horse-backed boss? Whoa, whoa, okay, what's going on here? You set foot into this shrine, I am Tal Nyag. I, okay, <laughs> that was fast. I didn't read it all. Oh, so do I get a choice here? Open the chest or open the chest? Let's open the chest. Might as well, what does it give me? What? Shields of the Mind's Eye. Oh, 16. Your inventory is full. All right, so we we definitely want that. We definitely do not want this embroidered shield, and so just drop that <laughs> right there on the just ground. Drop that trash. And let's uh, yeah, let's take that. Um, so we got two of these. Oh, nice. Uh, so I'm thinking we'll spiked just... Spiked Bobo shield. Oh, they do the same thing, too. Soldier shield, shield. All right, so we'll equip the shield to the mind. Yeah, and you got two of them. Look yeah. at how tiny it is. How does that protect me more? Because it's super eye mine, dude. How does, how does that... <laughs> There's another chest over there. How does that protect anything? Uh, It makes... It protects your forearm. Open this. Does he just walk in and just give you stuff? Eight... Fold blade, dude. Yeah, I'll be taking that. My inventory's full. Go figure. You need to find. You need to spend some time finding forest boy. You need to spend some time finding my foot. You are using a mouth. leaf to hold up one of your spots. The leaf is important, though, Jonas. It makes it so that I can uh, blow. <laughs> it's very important to blow always with you. It the is leaf always. is a utility item, and I don't honestly know where to get them from. Are you gonna make me fight? Oh, you gotta use your shield that it gives you to kill this thing, I think. Oh, fair. Use a side hop to avoid enemy attacks. This will create an opening you can strike back. All right. Side hop, target the enemy. Yep. Then use the thing to strafe yep. and then jump. Yep, I'm familiar with this. Come on. Oh, hit Y. Uh, <laughs> Done. What, do you think daddy ain't good? Man, that was my first do try. Do a backflip to avoid enemy attacks and create an opening to strike. Oh, it gives you stuff so you can use it in here, so. Yeah, that's fine. Backwards and then jump. Easy enough. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Oh, 
Oh, right. We're fine. That's fine. Not my first try that one. Oh, and then hit Y again. I'm sorry. This is my rusty claymore, too. I'm not even using my good ones. Good. I mean, you can repel an attack if you parry with your shield just at the right time. Strike back on the opening you create. So you just have to perfect guard, and then you can parry. Yeah, target Win. and then parry at the perfect time. Ready shield, and then, oh, and then you press B to parry. Yeah. Okay. Or not B, but A. Oh, God, wait, no. I need my shield. All right. Come on. Easy. Ease, come on, wow. man. What do you think? A video I mean, this game. Is, this is the shrine in the first village you come to, though, so. Yeah, Bill. Build up your power, then release it, doing lash. Oh, charged attacks. Okay. All You're right. like, I know about that. What the hell? Okay, dude. I need you to chill. You have to block. You have to parry his attack. Do I have to parry? I thought he just wanted me to do the charged attack. That's all it says. Oh. Do a charged attack. Oh, you were just trying to like charge it for a very long time. It yeah. just needed to be very minimal. I got you. You've done well. You've learned new skills. That's it. <laughs> I was supposed to learn these a long time ago, I guess. Yeah. I mean, I Why knew... Why didn't we go to the shrine in the village in the first place? I don't remember. I don't know. Ooh! That's a good sword. It's glowing. Yeah, oh, it's and a... it gave you ancient things, dude. That is a good sword. That is good. Wow. So I can actually... I can start using some of this other stuff, that I guess. Four, what's that? 14. That's okay. my boomerang. Oh, yeah. So I, I keep that. So I'm going to start using the sickle. We got some good weapons you again. Got your hammer and your sickle. Nicely done, dude. Oh, and another chest, dude. Oh, what else you want to give me? They give you all sorts of stuff in the beginning of the game. Yeah, man. They gave me some pretty decent weapons oh, this boy. early. Like, I, I could have come here a long time ago. Yeah, like on episode, like, six. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> so, is that, is that all for this one? Well, after I get the thing here. Yeah. But, uh, see if he says anything else or if he's splashing me his junk, his business. Test the strength uh, from the ashes, the hero. Yep, all of this is good stuff. Yeah, man, I guess that is it. Why are my sleeves green, Jonas? I don't like the green sleeves. Nope, there's no junk. So, yeah, on the next episode. <laughs> That's all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like and subscribe. If you've already done that, make sure you follow this guy on Twitch. TNT Night of My Man, I'm on Twitch every single day. That's at Twitch at 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock, whatever. Come and hang out with your boy live. TNT, D-I-N-O-M-I-G-H-T underscore crazy. Yeah. yeah. For Jonas. TNT. We are a Ota.